All right, what is up everyone? Kentucky Fried Chicken, KFC to people in the know, just brought back their two for $5 wraps and there's three versions now. I'm gonna be reviewing the newest version. They still have the uh, spicy slaw, the spicy slaw, and they also have, what's the other one? What's the other one? The classic, uh, but today we're gonna check out the mac and cheese wrap. Cue the intro. What is up everyone? It is the endorsement and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I could be very persuasive. It might be KFC day today because I might be doing, what am I saying? I am doing, well, I'm actually filming a new dessert. It's off camera right there. You might've already seen that video. I don't know. I don't know. Today, today is gonna happen the way it's gonna happen. So two for five dollars. These are the wraps. These are small, but for two fifty, I don't know. So this one right here, you can see it. Spicy slaw. Check it out right there. Not the best filming uh, lighting today. And this is the one we're going to check out today. Mac and cheese. So let's unwrap it. A little um, early Christmas gift. I like this little sticker. Look at this. Let's see if it comes off. Little mac and cheese sticker. Never hurt anybody. It's probably not gonna work too well, but look at that. Little mac and cheese with a little wrapper. All right, enough talking. It's small. Yeah, very small. Unwrap it. Mac and cheese, three cheese blend, and a chicken tender and sauce. Or no, no sauce. I don't think there's sauce. I think that's just cheese. Check it out right there. Horrible lighting. I apologize. But that's what we got going on. You see what's happening. Mac and cheese, three cheese blend, and a chicken tender. Let's give it a shot. All right, let's give it a shot. Let me give you one more look right there. $2.50. That's the size we're looking at right there. It's loaded with mac and cheese. I can even do a kind of a little of an unwrapping for you. Take a look. That's what we got inside this wrap. Little tortilla shell, wrap it back up. I guess I could have used a little bit more now that I have it actually open. Check it out. It'll focus, it'll focus. <laughs> worst time of day, worst overcast day. Not the largest tender. Thank God they're two for five. I think, what are they normally like? Three, 350? if you don't get this two for five deal. All right, let's go. The mac and cheese chicken wrap. Here we go. I definitely have some thoughts. Um, hmm. I like it. I don't love it. I think it needs more mac and cheese. I think it needs two to justify maybe, I don't know, the price at 250. It needs a little more chicken. That three cheese blend is basically non-existent in my opinion. You're already gonna have the cheese from the mac and cheese. I'm gonna tell you, that tender is a little dry. Definitely dry, and because there's not a lot of the cheese in the mac and cheese, kind of a dry bite. Flavor's okay. I don't know, KFC, Colonel, I'm not blown away by this. To me, these are a buck 99, based on the size and what you're getting on the inside. So even at the deal, $2.50, it is what it is. Yeah, it's good. 
not great. All right, I'm gonna give that a rating in a minute. I reviewed the uh, spicy slaw, the spicy slaw wrap. Let's open this uh, bad boy up, give you a little bonus look at this. Maybe I'll take yeah, one bite. There's the slaw in there. So that's the spicy slaw wrap. Let's take a bite of that. It's a lot of sauce right there. Mm. Whoo! Whoo! That had a little kick to it. Whoo! That had a little spice. I enjoyed the coleslaw on that one. Gave it more of like a, a fresh, a kind of a fresh feeling. So this one, Definitely um, comfort food personified. Um, I need a little bit of everything more in this and I need the chicken not to be as dry. I still enjoyed the um, 11 herbs and spices on the uh, kernel chicken. Uh, so that's good, not great. The other one was very spicy. Well, I'm gonna say not very spicy. It just kind of surprised me, especially after eating the first one. Um, but let's give the mac and cheese uh, wrap a uh, rating, shall we? Ooh, one to 100, man, <sighs> having the, having the 250 price tag factor in, um, on some small level, I think that's a $1.99 wrap all day based on the size, one to 100, solid 81. I'm going to give it an 81. I don't remember what I gave the other two, uh, when the wraps first came out, but, um, yeah, 81, and we're going to stick to it. I feel good about that score. I think it could be better. Got to put some more cheese in there. Maybe some type of nacho cheese sauce that kind of meshes with the mac and cheese if your mac and cheese is not going to be uh, creamy when it's inside the wrap. Just my opinion. So um, there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Have I been crooked this whole time? Please don't forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media, getting the word of my channel out to the masses. In closing, better take this off before I start walking around with mac and cheese chicken wrap on my chest. Kind of looks like uh, old school scratch and sniff. Is it going to smell like mac and cheese? No.